Welcome back. As we head into this game uh, number one, IHC up against SF Plus 4. Our mouth, stop the share, please. Exclamation mark. Tip our mouth because he forgot to turn off the Discord. And FBZ suddenly dies. Tempo did want here on the side of for SF Pause 4. The side of IHC are still finding some very nice farm though. Armel rotating up top, gets the onslaught forward onto 11 with the trample. They will find that pesky timber saw. Walking to the small camps, TPs are coming in. They spot out Kishka. Working Soul does get Fade vaulted up. Where's the damage? Left back into the stun onto Ace 12. FBZ coming in for the chase down. Portrait Soul is just dead. And now it looks like everyone's just going to be dying here as Rams does come in. He does have Vortex. Pulverite comes in as the Bushwhack flies out. Great breakup from Kishka. Get the Vortex off onto FBZ. Still has some mana to get away there, but Ace 12 will fall in the end and Kishka will follow. A smorgasbord set up for SF Boss 4. They will find themselves another for Mel. A triple kill in the most, uh, frankly, uh, unexciting fashion coming. 8 minute rune is down bot, and that's gonna be the invis being snag up here by DJ. Get the storm hammer off and pulverize onto that storm. Rams out of mana, out of his life. As Armel just getting chopped down by 11, but it doesn't matter. The damage is not good enough as Kishka misses another bushwhack with a trample running, breaking the tree. 1 to 7. SF pause 4. Crushing down the side of IHC as FBZ will get the Doom off onto the troll. Wants to turn around and get that chase. Gets a stun from the TP. Fortune Soul is gone. Uh, what was that? That was basically FBZ alone. Get the stolen thunderclap as well. Ace 12 set to fall as the little bug is on him, and Ghost will get that pickup for himself. Graf going here. Get the stun out. Ace 12 is gone. Stolen thunderclap again. For DJ. SF Boss 4. Apparently, it makes all the difference when you can wake up and play the game. Let's go on to Fortune Soul. Doom's out. He's just dead. 1 to 13. 5k lead for SF Boss 4. Mr. Carl Kill, if you have any complaints, as the onion has said, if you have a complaint, write it on the letter and send it to the hospital where you were born. That's from a very good onion skit. Uh, Armel, I mean, he has no mana, but he has amp damage. We'll get the onslaught down. Bot, now you don't have mana either on Rams. Just enough to maybe cast a couple of spells. We'll jump and commit onto Armel, but he's being healed up and has the uproar. Blade Nail is up as well. Smoking back for 11. Fully mana back up, Armel. Does cancel the pulverize. Is certain drop low. Mel! Okay. Gives away a 9 kill streak. On to 11. That is, uh, ah, rather unfortunate. Very good opening for IHC. Arcs and the one. We'll get the control onto FBZ. Double chakrams do hurt with a whirling death. The doom does fly out onto FBZ. He will fall as a TP wait. Oh, Armel manages to clip that hurricane a little bit too slow. The tornado a little bit slow on keeping him up. And Ace 12 is gone now as well. FBZ more than happy to sacrifice. 11 does have a lot of damage with the Kaya Blink. You can try to reposition and set that tempo for the team. It will run up. Armel instantly onslaughting away. It's DJ left for the Wolves. Does get the mech off, but gets deleted by 11 again with that rolling. That's still Armel not letting go of this position just yet. Wants to re-engage, gets the Pulverize off. Bushwhack isn't quite there, so the manage to get some good damage in along with the Glade Mirror. Is it going to be enough with that stun from Cast Awake? Yes, it is. Good stun out from FBZ holding down Rams, but he does have the man to back away as Ghost will just delete Kishka one more time. We've got a pest problem here. We don't have any big on on hand. Time to call up Grab. Smoke broken already on the low ground. Okay. Can be exposed. FBZ just runs up. They want to catch Rams, but he just uh, zips right through. Perhaps Ace 12 would be a juicy target. They get the root and the storm hammer. Bushwhack does connect. But now there's nothing to stop our melt. We'll get the pulverize down, and now you have the Cinder Brew on FBZ, on DJ. I mean, your damage is actually mainly on 11 as he gets doomed up. Maybe looking to try it. No, it doesn't have a TP. He's just dead here. Not even a cheeky play to do. We'll try to deny, perhaps, but FBZ will take that for himself. 
We sold Blink into Midas. Fortune Soul getting pulverized. Bushwhacked will connect this time around from Fishka. But they've got the Gleipnir and they've got the run. Fortune Soul can't even pop Battle France. Ace 12 is also set to fall as his Brulings just melts. No HP to be found here. And they leave the. S oh, they don't have detection for the Invis Storm Brulings. We managed to bail out. Meanwhile, down mid, they do get the shot out onto FEZ, but the uh, pipe does manage to turn on in time. Rams not really able to bleed as they charge forward. They find the squirrel. They kill the squirrel in its natural habitat, as the predator that RML is. Man. Have you seen. Uh, uh, okay. 11 kills that thought, and it does get lifted out. Why am I even bothering? There's no play here whatsoever, they just die. It scales. As they get the hold, Lincoln's up on Rams. At least the Gleipnir will not affect him. Lotus Orb out early as well. SF pause 4. Ghost held back. Sharpshooter up. They get the Doom off before the split can come in from Ace 12. He's got some spacing coming out that leaves space for Fortune Soul as well to get this Battle France off. FEZ. Frank getting healing true, but not enough. They will delete 11 inside. Fortune Soul now, without the Battle Trance, doesn't have the damage. It's going to fall in the middle. They will kill off DJ. Mana starting to run low here on Rams. Will try to TP ways that their damages are stunned. No. Armel blinks in, doesn't get the Pulverize off. Is 12 with a Storm Creep brewing. Will he kept alive as he still has his Earth Panda running away. Get the amp damage off with a pulverize down, trying to hold back 11, and he is dead with blade mail on from Armel. Again, Armel having a free for all buffet on IHG's behalf as Ace 12 will now die as well. They get the zip forward, get the bushwhack as well, and they will manage to kill off Cast Awake. Time to go back to Cast the Sleep. Uh, I'd say Spam Silog, Corn Silog. Tossy log, tapsy log, all rank, almost equal, depends on my mood as they get the bushwhack into the zip onto Ghost. Does still have the time lapse, will come that back in. Big doom out from FPZ, holds back that Tim as they get the pulverize out onto Fortune Soul. Will BKB away, still has that battle trance as well. The high ground is gonna melt IHC. Need to find some magic at the end of August score date, 831. And that damage once his Yakuchi is true and gets a right click off. Overwhelming Armel links forward. Does not quite have pulverized. Isn't able to onslaught anyone a little bit backwards. Midrax will fall. SF boss 4. Is kind of falling apart. We'll find the lift back. Rams is gone. Has buyback. Gem is dropped. Castaway will get the picture of Gem again as he gets the pulverized forward onto Ace. Late near out as well. Ace does not have split. And a zip forward from BJ is going to kill him off. Get the slows out. Get some damage in. High ground set to fall. This one's over. This is over. I think IHC hit shift enter. Press G twice. And this can all be over. They will buy back. We'll go for one last fight. Armel. In the middle, Ghost just melting here is what is out, but Aegis does expire. Time lapse on cooldown for a little bit longer here as well, so there is a window. But it gets control and the pulverize again onto 11 GG's call. That's it. That is all she wrote. As SF Boss 4 will take game number one in very strong fashion. It is Armel SF, and you get DJ and Castaway on Sven Rubik, so they aren't sticking to the namesake. Maybe down the line we'll get SF Boss 4.
<laughs> I have a good lunch. Thanks for asking. Ugh. Excuse me. I just have to get the top two located. Possible. Get back into the actual game. Eight to eight. 4K lead still for SF Pawsport. Looks like they've had a fantastic time here. This ghost is cleaning up. Uh, oh yeah, that's what the hell happened there. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, we were talking about it in draft, like SF versus Ember. It's really good. Invis into Requiem, and that's really good too. Almost equal. They will kill Armel. Okay. Chat, Tom Cruise wouldn't lie to us, right? Get this jump out in Kishka. Not a meaningful kill, but... Okay, alright. 